Hey guys, welcome to the part 6 of Alien Wake 2. It's exactly 1.39 here in the middle of night. And I really like to play all of the horror game in the night. So, today I work. Okay, let's just continue. So we are exploring subway right now. So I work from morning. I changed my ship to morning. So I can play this game in the night. This new plot beat would carry me deeper into the story. Changing a plot element in a scene without being there was impossible. Just a second, guys. I couldn't add a new element from here. I'd have to go to the scene. Then change here. The drifters had scrawled their symbol on the wall. A secret for those in the know. The plot changed the details of the world. Oh shit. Shit, 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 It's not gonna open, it's not gonna open. I'm 
I couldn't hear the dark presence. It was gone. That's some fucked up shit. The tunnel was open now. I could get through. Shit. Shit. Oh, shit. My stomach. Shit. Oh, mommy. I, I was really scared. Shit. I think I should turn on the lights. The drifters had scrawled their symbol on the wall. A secret for those in the know. The torchbearers painted the tree there. The tree of knowledge. The tree of life with its roots reaching down to hell. The plot element I found would drive the story forward. Come on, come on. Oh, I'm pressing D. Or I'm pressing F. What the hell? I, sh sh I should press like... Had scrolled their symbol on the wall. Tree for all the good A secret is. for those in the know. a new beat for the story. I was making my way deeper into the story. I could imagine this murder cult performing their macabre acts beyond the collapsed tunnel. The cultists laid the Casey novel onto the altar with reverence. Their twisted Bible. He's not running that fast, sir. Presence. 
It was gone. Fat tire again. open now. I could get through. I had seen it before. I remember. Okay. It was always out there, hunting me. Oof. You know, I thought this would be a better strategy. Like. Oh, hell no, man. It's it's two AM. I'm playing this game. How dumb can I be? The guy. Sh shit. Somehow the victim's heart was the key. Shit. My mate, please. Something had shifted. I felt an overwhelming closeness to home. An FBI agent? Who are you? What is this? Who are you? She can hear me. I'm Saga Anderson. You know, this is the scariest game I ever played. I'm trapped here. The dark place. Under Cauldron Lake. Under Cauldron Lake. And you. I'm trying to escape. I'm making progress, but I'm in danger. Dark presence. Help me. Please, help me. I could sense it. I was close to home. Had the woman in the vision helped me somehow? Something had changed outside Parliament Tower, where I had lived with Alice. It was out there, waiting for me. Ooh. So finally, okay, we we are so close to end the part. We should complete it on the. Last run, but now. Nah. Who was writing who? Who was writing this poem? Me? No.
station had changed. I was closer now. That's all clothes. I'm outside time and space, outside reality. But this is real. A nightmare dimension, an ocean of darkness. Remember, it's dark energy can make art come true, make dreams and nightmares come true. Yes, I can use this. I need to use this. Hungry, monstrous things. Up there. Bodies to stop me. They devour me. Become me. Oh no. to being home going up to our apartment would i be home or was this just an echo of the real thing even then the murder site had brought me one step closer to escape Edge of the plaza was ringing again. Hey, Alan. Thank God it picked up. I thought I lost you again. Who are you? Why are you helping me? Did you go deeper to the overlap? Are you talking about the murder site? Yeah, I, I did. I, I. That's fantastic, Alan. We're closer to getting out. We're making progress. We would be if you would answer my damn questions. Last time we spoke, you were pretty worried about Alice. Did you ever check Parliament Tower? To make sure she really got out of the dark place? Well, of course she got out. That's why I'm here. That's the whole goddamn point. Be very careful, Alan. The dark presence is stealing from you. It can already manifest as your double. Scratch will come. Wait, wait, hello? I don't know for some reason this game is constantly shit running on 18 FPS. Alice's photo equipment set to go off when the door opens. the door to my study where I wrote my books this symbol wasn't here before this is a photo of scratch how did Alice get this is he stalking her
Alice's video camera. No memory card inside. On screens. door wouldn't open. Oh. Part one. What was Alice working on? You know, it's really hard because of my glasses. The headphones are really hurting on back of my ear. When I was younger, photography was everything to me. I moved to New York thinking I'd make it as an artist. And then I met Alan. We had a good thing. We were both dedicated by our creative ambitions. The only difference was that Alan's work made money. He brought me work when he could. I took his promo shots, um, created covers for his books. I'm sure he forced his publisher into it. I was taking photos, just not my photos. And that nod at me. Things got complicated sometimes, but that's life, right? We loved each other. Then uh, Alan hit a block. I brought out a meaner side of him. One I didn't like. years ago, I started hearing noises in the night, typewriter keys clacking, voices. Alan was back, haunting me. Then 
and it got violent. It was Alan. And yet, it was a monster. He always did have anger in him. I set up cameras around the apartment with motion sensors and flashes. Now, when the monster comes, I turn it into art. My nightmares caught on film. And this is the focus of my new exhibition. To show people the world is so much darker than they ever knew. I'm calling this exhibit the dark place. Alice. Scratch was terrorizing her. Why? Why he look like Jack Dylan had out? The story had brought me here, brought me nowhere. Look me back. I was writing the story. And in the story, I now stepped into the writer's room. But there was no one here writing. I really like the dark presence. His close change. Okay, let's recap what you've told us so far, Ellen. For the past 13 years, you've been trapped in a nightmare dimension called the Dark Place. Yeah. It's like New York, but it's not New York. And can be reached from the bottom of Cauldron Lake, but it's not really under the lake. And after all this time, you've managed to get out. Yeah, yeah. But so has your evil doppelganger, Mr. Scratch. Or is it the dark presence? Both. It's interchangeable. He's Scratch when he looks like me, but he can change into this other form. And Scratch, the dark presence, wants to rewrite the world in his own image. Which would be in your image, as he looks just like you. And turn the world into a fucking nightmare. During Deerfest, which is scheduled to take place in a couple of days. You got out of the dark place by writing a novel. The pages we've been finding but your double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality taking over people yeah. making them crazy bringing the dark place to bright falls yes fiction coming in contact with the dark place can change reality 
The story is coming true, soaking into everything, like, like, like darkness when it, when night falls. But last time, it... this will be back in 2010. Yes, last time it didn't happen all at once. The story came true bit by bit as it unfolded, and that dark presence was still bound to the lake. I stopped it before it got the ending it wanted, before it broke free. Based on that, there's still time. Which brings us to your magical light switch. The clicker. Magical doesn't quite cover it. Scratch wants it to bring about his ending. That, that can't happen. If I can get the clicker, I, I can send him back to the dark place, make all the shit go away. Look, I know it's batshit crazy. My memory is, is full of holes, and I, I'm not sure how much I can trust. It, it's like it's like it's like a half-forgotten dream. <laughs> Mr. Wake, Alan. There's something wrong with Alex Casey. Casey. What I want to know is, why am I? Why are we written into the story? I think I saw you. Or a vision of you in the dark place. I think you helped me reach out and escape somehow. With that in the story, Scratch would have edited it to get to you. To hurt you. We are all in danger. Okay, we're back to Mrs. Watson. I, I forgot the name. And there's so much of it. <sighs> so that's it for today's guys. Sorry for the short video. I have a work tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. And also I have a exam on Monday. So that's it for today guys.